Yo, what's going on guys? T-Mart here, and this GTA video is a little bit different than what you're used to seeing. We already put up today's live episode, so make sure you guys check that out. But anyway, I want to let you guys know about the High Life update that's coming this Tuesday, May 13th, here in just a couple of days. There's a lot of new stuff that's being added to the game, and I'll let you guys know about it. It was just announced yesterday, and it's uh, it's pretty exciting. So, uh, first up, properties. We've got five new high-end apartments being added to the game in places like the Eclipse Towers and Richard's Majestic and stuff. So, like, the super high-end, really expensive, really nice. One, so that's kind of cool, as well as multi property ownership is now going to be an option. So now you can have two properties at once, and kind of a side effect with that is that if you buy two properties that have 10 garage spaces, you now have 20 garage spaces, so you can own up to 20 vehicles, which is really, really cool, and that's the thing. I'm most excited about. Now, uh, along with that, there are new vehicles. You know, you need new vehicles to fill up those spaces, so there are four new vehicles being added to the game. There's the Enos Huntley S, which is an SUV, the Dubaki Masakro, which is a sports car, the Pegasi Zentorno, which is a supercar, and then also the Dinka Thrust, which is a new motorcycle. And then on top of all of that, something I'm very, very excited about, one of the coolest announcements of this, uh, this update, is the fact that they're adding in no contact Races. So what happens there is the enemies or like the other people you're racing against are, uh, are are kind of like you know semi translucent. You can kind of see through them and you can drive through them. You don't run into each other. You don't spin each other out. You can still like run into trees and road signs and things like that, like obstacles on the road. But you physically can't ram other players. So uh, you know that's part of what make makes racing really really fun. But also is part of what makes it frustrating. I feel like some races are going to be fun to play in no contact mode. So that's pretty cool. Uh, next up we got a new gun coming which is the bullpup rifle. It's supposed to be really, really good. We'll have to wait and find out. Uh, then there's also the mental state addition to the game, and this is like one of the most useful things that they're adding in. So uh, it says that you can see how passive or psychotically unhinged fellow players in your current session really are, so you'll know whether you need to be ready when they approach. So uh, this is going to be some sort of symbol or some sort of way for you to tell when like somebody's coming close to you are they on a massive killing spree where they're like shooting everybody in their path or are they nice? Are they being friendly? You know, it's going to be nice to have that because sometimes I shoot people who aren't trying to shoot back and then other times I don't shoot at people who are trying to shoot me because you can't ever tell, you know, what those people are thinking. So that's kind of cool that, uh, that they're adding that in. And then finally... Last but not least, we've got some other stuff here. We've got, we've got all kinds of new wardrobe options. We've got some new horns for the vehicles. We've got new toasts and celebrations for like after winning a match and things like that. And then we've also got 15 new jobs being added to the game. So man, that was a mouthful. There is a lot coming to Grand Theft Auto Online this Tuesday. It's a free update. It automatically happens when you load the game up. So uh, be excited for that, guys. Be excited for videos to come out of this thing. We're going to check out all the new vehicles, all the new weapons, all the new everything. And, and yeah, it should be pretty cool. So thank you guys so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. More GTN line stuff coming soon. And uh, peace out, guys.